The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE United States Championship. Here comes the Viper. The most lethal superstar in WWE history. You know, Randy Orton watched his father in the very first WrestleMania main event, and then he went on to main event multiple WrestleManias of his own. Now, this is a stage where he's faced the likes of The Undertaker, Triple H, and John Cena. We have seen Randy Orton go from being known as a legend killer to a legend. And we know Orton only needs three letters to create the ultimate WrestleMania moment. R. K O He's facing an amazingly talented rookie in the form of Logan Paul. So I hope he treats Paul as the real threat that he is. Gentlemen, stand up and cheer this social media icon. He's just as flashy as ever. He belongs on the WrestleMania stage. Logan Paul certainly loves soaking up the spotlight. Knows how to make a WrestleMania caliber entrance. Remember when he wrote a zip line to the ring? <laughs> well, WrestleMania is all about turning things up, and Logan's great at that. Could be another great WrestleMania performance for Paul. Introducing the challenger from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 275 pounds, the Viper, Randy Orton! And his opponent from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 205 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, Logan Paul! Winning the United States Championship etches your name with legendary company. There is a certain excitement that a United States Championship match has. It's hard to nail down exactly what it is. I know what you mean, Byron, whether defending or challenging for the U.S. title. Superstars seem to go the extra mile. Big forearm. Drake. All the way up. Across the top rope. Stun gun. Big, big back body drop. What elevation. 
elimination. On the move. Picking up speed. Oh, what a splash. Isolating their opponent's arm and oh. And a series of vicious stomps. And if the first stomp doesn't send you the message, the follow-up ones definitely will. The methodical style of Orton got a bit stalled there. Yeah, Paul looked like a natural with that one. Many superstars have butted heads with Randy Orton over the years. From what you've seen in those matches, what's a winning strategy against the Viper? You have to match the Viper's intensity. If you're not fighting twice as hard as he is, then he's going to devour you. So get your head in the game and attack like you mean it. Blink and you miss it. Power slam by Orton. And into the count. Dying a two count there. And those kickouts are only going to get harder. Oh my God, a DDT! Spiked him. Uh-oh. Propelled himself to the outside with a clothesline. That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. Stop gloating and put your attention back to the match. Uh, shots to the body. Oh, punishing combination. Locks in the gut wrench. Suplex. Caught an elbow to the gut for that effort. Say what you will about Logan Paul. The kid's got confidence. He's back in so close to a countout. You do not want to lose that way. Boy, you're a pin up for cut. Oh, sharp knee. Champ taking the worst end of the exchange. Yeah, Orton looked so crisp there. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Right across the larynx. Continuing to dissect the leg of his opponent. Oof. Mind games in full effect from the apex. Oh my gosh, what impact. Into the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. And just that quick, the Viper can turn the tides of this matchup. Power slam by Orton. The Viper with meticulous, agonizing stumps. Put into the cover with the title on the line. New champion, new champion. Forces the shoulder up after two. So, so close. That could have been it. The Vipers lined up his prey. We know what's next. Whoa! The title might change hands. Try to end it. There it is. Randy Orton is your new champion. Here is your winner. And new WWE. United States Champion, The Viper, Randy Orton! I still can't believe it. There you see our new champion. The now former champion obviously not happy with this outcome. I did not think a title change was in the cards here tonight.